Douglas C-54 Skymaster The Douglas C-54 Skymaster was a four-engine transport aircraft used by the United States Army Air Forces in World War II and the Korean War. Like the Douglas C-47 Skytrain, the C-54 Skymaster was derived from a civilian airliner. Besides transport of cargo, the C-54 also carried presidents, prime ministers and military staff. Dozens of variants of the C-54 were employed in a wide variety of non-combat roles such as air-sea rescue, scientific and military research and missile tracking and recovery. During the Berlin airlift it hauled coal and food supplies to West Berlin. After the Korean War it continued to be used for military and civilian uses by more than 30 countries. This was one of the first aircraft to carry the President of the United States and to assume the call sign Air Force One. Operational History C-54s began service with the U.S. Army Air Forces in 1942, carrying up to 26 passengers. Later versions carried up to 50 passengers. The United States Navy also acquired the type, under the designation of 5D. The C-54 was one of the most commonly used long-range transports by the U.S. Armed Forces in World War II. Of the C-54s produced, 515 were manufactured in Santa Monica, California and 655 were manufactured at Orchard Place Douglas Field, in unincorporated Cook County, Illinois, near Chicago, later the site of O'Hare International Airport. After World War II, the C-54 continued to serve as the primary airlift of the new United States Air Force and with the United States Navy. In late 1945, Several hundred C-54s were surplus to U.S. military requirements and these were converted for civil airline operation, many by Douglas Aircraft at its aircraft plants. The aircraft were sold to airlines around the world. By January 1946, Pan American Airways was operating their Skymasters on transatlantic scheduled services to Europe and beyond. Trans-Pacific schedules from San Francisco to Auckland began on June 6, 1946. President Harry S. Truman signed the National Security Act of 1947, which created the U.S. Air Force, on board Sacred Cow, the presidential C-54 which is preserved at the National Museum of the United States Air Force. More than 300 C-54s and a 5DS formed the backbone of the U.S. contribution to the Berlin Airlift in 1948. They also served as the main airlift during the Korean War. After the Korean War, the C-54 was replaced by the Douglas C-124 Globemaster II, but continued to be used by the U.S. Air Force until 1972. During World War II, the C-54 was used by Franklin D. Roosevelt. Douglas MacArthur and Winston Churchill. The American delegates to the Casablanca Conference used the Skymaster. The C-54 was also used by the Royal Air Force, the Armée de l'Air and the armed forces of at least 12 other nations. The last active C-54 Skymaster in U.S. Navy service, C-54Q, BU No. 56501, of the Navy Test Pilot School, NAS Patrick St. River was retired on April 2, 1974. After disposal by the U.S. Air Force and U.S. Navy, many C-54s were modified for use in the civilian firefighting and air tanker roles. This included fitting tanks inside and under the fuselage and the fitting of dumping and spraying equipment also on the wing trailing edges. C-54s continued in this role until the late 1990s. Accidents and Incidents Disappearance 1950 On January 26, 1950, a C-54D operated by the United States Air Force disappeared during a flight between Anchorage Amendorf Air Force Base, Alaska, and Great Falls Malmstrom Air Force Base, Montana, with a crew of 8 and 36 passengers, 34 service personnel and 2 civilians. No trace of the aircraft or its occupants has ever been found. Berlin Corridor Attack 1952 On April 29, 1952, an Air France Douglas C-54A, registration FBELI, 
operating a scheduled service from Frankfurt Rhein Main Airport to Berlin Tempelhof Airport came under sustained attack from two Soviet MiG-15 fighters while passing through one of the Allied air corridors over East Germany. Although the attack had severely damaged the aircraft, necessitating the shutdown of engines number no. 3 and 4, the pilot in command of the aircraft managed to carry out a safe emergency landing at Tempelhof Airport. A subsequent inspection of the aircraft's damage revealed that it had been hit by 89 shots fired from the Soviet MiGs. There were no fatalities among the 17 occupants, 6 crew, 11 passengers, despite the severity of the attack. The Soviet military authorities defended this attack on an unarmed civilian aircraft by claiming the Air France plane was outside the air corridor at the time of attack. Shot down 1954 on July 23, 1954, a Douglas C-54 Skymaster civilian airliner, registration VRHEU, operated by Cathay Pacific Airways, en route from Bangkok to Hong Kong, was shot down by Chinese Communist La-9 fighters off the coast of Hainan Island, killing 10. Disappearance 1964 On March 28, 1964, a C-54A disappeared over the Pacific, about 11.20 km west of San Francisco, last reported position, 29 deg 20 N 135 deg 0 W 29.33 deg N 135.00 deg W 29.33 135.00 on an executive passenger flight from Honolulu International Airport. Hawaii to Los Angeles International Airport, California. The pilot reported a fire in number two engine, which might make it necessary to ditch. Nothing more was heard from the aircraft, nor was any trace of it found despite an extensive search. Three crew and six passengers died in the accident. Specification C-54G General Characteristics Crew, 4 Capacity, 50 troops, length, 93 feet 10 inches, 28.6 m, wingspan, 117 feet 6 in, 35.8 m, height, 27 feet 6 in, 8.38 m, wing area, 1,460 feet 2, 136 m 2, empty weight, 38,930 pounds, 17,660 kilograms, loaded weight, 62,000 pounds, 28,000 kilograms, max takeoff weight, 73,000 pounds, 33,000 kilograms, power plant, 4X Pratt & Whitney R2000-9 radial engines, 1,450 horsepower, 1,080 kilowatts, each. Performance. Maximum speed, 275 miles per hour, 239 kn. 442 km per hour, cruise speed, 190 miles per hour, 165 kn, 310 km per hour, range, 4,000 miles, 6,400 km, service ceiling, 22,300 feet, 6,800 m, wing loading, 42.5 pounds per foot 2, 207 kg per meter 2, power mass, 0.094 horsepower per pound, 160 watts per kilogram. Notable appearances in media A C-54, registration CFIQM, Buffalo 5 to 721, tail 57, was used as a substitute Lancaster bomber due to its similar top speed and maximum payload, for a recreation of Operation Chastise with its bouncing bomb. It was filmed in the UK documentary Dambusters, Building the Bouncing Bomb, Canadian documentary Dambusters Fly Again, Nova Season 39 Episode Bombing Hitler's Dams, and Ice Pilots and WT Season 3 Episode 2 Dambusters. The movie The Big Lift, starring Montgomery Clift shows extensive operations of the C-54 as it was shot on location during the peak of the Berlin Airlift in 1949.